Welcome back guys, Mike here, Mike's DVDs, Blu-rays, my collection. Today is a very special episode. I have two unboxings to do. Uh, birthday, my birthday was recently. And I got two. One thing for my wife, and the second I ordered myself. Um, and uh, the other is, I just want to show off, I got this recently, the Friday the 13th, the series, the uh, collection, the TV series. This came on 87, 88, 89, maybe 90, three seasons. Uh, I thought it was really good. I used to watch this back in the day on Saturday nights around midnight. I would watch the Headbangers Ball on MTV and um, this would be on so I would, I would kind of go back and forth at times and uh, I think it, they showed it another time and I would watch it then too but but man Saturday night was the night was this and the Headbangers Ball for a while there in the early 80s and I mean the late 80s yeah. um, so moving right on so uh, this is an unboxing I do. This came from Eureka, uh, Eureka Video in in England, in the UK, and uh, got this delivered by Royal Mail the other day. And I'm gonna open it up. It's a uh, unboxing. I'm doing a first unboxing. I got these for myself uh, as a birthday present. They were running a pretty good sale, a uh, little bit off. So let me show you what I got here. Uh, these are from Eureka Entertainment in the UK, the Region 2 Blu-rays. Uh, first I got a Spilone, or Spilone, or uh, German for Spies, uh, Fritz Lang movie, 1928. Um, I have the Kino edition on uh, DVD, but that's a uh, pretty older print of it. I think it goes back to the 90s sometime. I think this is a new restoration, I believe. Um, but anyways, I'm going to check it out. Um, I really like Eureka. They got a lot of cool movies. Here's a... Here's a movie I don't have in my collection and was always a fan of this. I have this on Laserdisc, actually. actually. Uh, this is The Lost Weekend by Billy Wilder. Um, in my early days of being a film fan, I was really into Billy Wilder. I was getting... I was actually copying them. I was copying them off of TV, like uh, Showtime, the movie channel back in the days. I'm talking... <clears throat> excuse me, early 90s, uh, back then Showtime and Movie Channel would show a lot of older stuff in the early morning hours and stuff. And the Movie Channel used to be really super cool back in the day. They would show a lot of older stuff. So I caught up on a lot of Billy Wilder movies, especially his uh, later United Artists stuff, uh, 1960s, 50s, stuff like that. But anyways, this one was Paramount, and uh, I, I came across this somewhere. I had it copied on VHS, so this is my first uh, really nice edition of it. I have it on Laserdisc, which is you know pretty old edition. So, uh, Nick, I'm really excited about this. Um, Anthony Mann's The uh, Man from Laramie, uh, Jimmy Stewart movie. Uh, I believe this was the last Western in their little series of awesome 1950s Westerns that him and Anthony Mann did in the 50s. I really love them, and I've really, uh, I've, I've got some Blu-ray editions of them. I had a Jimmy Stewart pack that had those Westerns in it. And I think you had to get The Man from Laramie separately from Columbia. Um... And uh, I had those. And um, I have them on Laserdisc too. Uh, Man from Laramie, um, a Japanese Laserdisc edition. That was 
the only way, but it wasn't wasn't widescreen. I was really disappointed in that. I don't know why they weren't letterbox widescreen. But anyways, I got this now from Eureka. So this is super cool. It's a dual format. It's got the DVD and the Blu-ray. It's got some pretty cool art there. And uh, this is number 156 on the, on the spine number 156. And finally, I got 1944's Double Indemnity from Billy Wilder also. Um, I have this on Blu-ray and um, I actually have it on DVD and Laserdisc actually. So this is going to be a nice little addition. Uh, it's got some bonus, bonus features here. I'm not sure if this is a new... A new restoration or anything it doesn't say it just says a new high definition restoration which just means you know they probably just transferring and stuff so anyway i'm really excited about that this is a uh, spine number 44 so there you have it those are this is what i got myself for my birthday uh spilloni just spine number 90 from fritz lang I wonder if I did I talk enough about Fritz Lang. Fritz Lang is really great. I, I'm um, I'm gonna have another video soon. I got some more Eureka movies that should be in the mail. It, but during this coronavirus stuff, so it might be a little while. But I got some later Sprit, uh, Fritz Lang movies. Uh, some of his um, uh, noir movies and stuff. So that's cool. I got that. Uh, Lost Weekend, Spine Number 45, Man from Laramie, Spine Number 156, and Double Indemnity, Spine Number 44. So, let's put that to the side. Now, this is what my, my wife, my fiance, got me for my birthday. Um, you know, as you get older, you're silly about your birthday and stuff, but um, I'm just like, yeah, if you gotta give me something, I've been... I've had my eyes on this for a long time. I've been waiting for the price to go down. Now I have it on Blu-ray, but it's only the first of the it, the first movies in the in 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 the series. Like you know, one two, the first movie of all the series. Now this is going to have that and all of the sequels that go to each one. Now you might know what I'm what I have here. But it's the Universal Classic Monsters series. And this, you gotta love this packing peanuts. Like, that really helped a whole lot. But this has all of the sequels, like all the Draculas, all the mummies, all the Frankensteins, uh, Wolfman, and I think it's got the... Uh, Abbott and Costello ones on here too. Uh, Meet the Mummy and Frankenstein, Invisible Man. It's got the Invisible Man, all that on there. So 1931 to 1956. The Universal Monsters, Classic Monsters. It's got a 48 page collectible book. So I'm a big fan of this, of this, of this series. Um, I guess this would be a franchise now, but this was the original franchise, the Universal Monsters. Man, it's pretty. It's pretty nice little box. Um, I have all those ones from the early two thousands. Uh, the green cases of Frankenstein, Dracula, Invisible Man, all those. The slip case, real nice. They were real nice slip case, and on those it had all had all the movies Dracula and all all the you know all the in the series on each one this nice little clamshell little snapper slider thing so um I'll show those in another video when I show off all of them but but this yeah this was for my birthday so I'm really excited about this thanks honey and um so I got myself some watching to do can't wait been really looking forward to these waited a good while for those to come in the mail I let them sit for about a week in case it got any coronavirus on it so um anyways i hope you guys like this video this episode uh give me a like give me a comment give me a middle finger give me something just give me something
Tell me you're out there. Show me your hands. Let's do it. Anyways, I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Whoever watches, I'm thanking you. And I'm going to try to do my, do my best to, to entertain you guys with videos. So anyways, we all can't be the same. There's all kinds of video people out there with their collections and stuff, man. So I'm trying. I'm trying. I'll do a little dance, do some break dancing or something. Just to get your, uh, get your attention. So anyways, this is Mike and I am out. That's so good. I'm out.